There is insane activity in the apiary today. I mean, look at this. Smoker is lit. It's April 9th, uh, Northeast Ohio. We are um, about 78 degrees, so perfect day to get in and check some colonies. Uh, yesterday we had that eclipse thing and I'll put a little image and stuff up in there. Super, super cool. Um, my one colony down there, one of the busier ones, has one of the B-Dars on it from Broodminder. So I'm really curious. That is one of the 200 locations uh, that was selected. They are collecting data as far as the bee behavior related to the eclipse. Today, I'm gonna go through and do some spot checks, check some things in the apiary here. Uh, I need to really get a move on and then start getting these insulated inner covers off, just transition that over. Um, we really don't have any freezing days. So um, I've got two new stands also here. Uh, I've got some stands, you know, original ones that I built that aren't quite as wide so that the, you know, hive bodies sit down into it. So I'm gonna switch those out, just get some things done. So let's get some inspection started. Now right there, what you see, that is that appy tablet that dripped down through here. Yep, look at that. Oh man, beautiful queen on there. You can see her there, kind of that darker color. Nice brood pattern on there, little. This is one of my smaller colonies. So they're gonna start building up. I can see some wet nectar in there, that is nice. There's a, a nice little grouping of eggs in there. Eggs right there tells me, well, my queen has been there within the last 24 hours. Now we see right on there, that's a little practice cup. What colonies will do is when they're building like what this one is, they will pump out drones. They're gonna start practicing with cups and they're gonna get ready to swarm. Well, this colony here, uh, the last time I was in it, I remember they did not have a lot of brood up in this super, but they were starting to build it out. I expect to see brood right there like that. Fantastic, fantastic. Now what I'm looking for here are just any cups down there and I'm probably gonna give them another a uh, piece of a pollen patty there. A little cup right here on this. There's nothing in it. So eggs on here, so you know I'm just glancing real quick to see if I can see my queen. Um, she, you know, is an elusive one. Well, we got some work done. Now this colony here is little as what it was. I put a little bit of brood in there. We'll see what it does. I just need to, you know, get this colony building up. So hopefully, I did not sabotage it. Now moving down, you know, these other colonies are starting to brood up. Um, you know, they've got brood in there. Uh, that colony is doing outstanding. The three back there, outstanding. The one over in the corner is starting to brood up as well. So overall, they're looking good. Um, we should be, uh, I would imagine in the next two to three weeks, making splits. So, you know, I just saw the startings of some cups, smash them down. I didn't see any that were charged. So, you know, they're telling me, hey, at least my stronger colonies are saying, hey, we are thinking about it. We're getting ready. So that's all part of the process. They will build up. They'll lay that drone brood. Uh, you know, they'll start to build those practice cups, and then they're going to swarm. So, you know, I'll just have to keep an eye. Today, like I said, is April 9th. 
So I'm thinking, you know, probably by about the 20, between the 20th and 25th, I will see some cells. So and have to, you know, be splitting and things like that. So it, it's going to get busy here real soon. But that's the update. Um, you know, real curious as far as, you know, when I'm going to do my splits and things like that and set these things up for single brood, uh, be curious to see how it works out. You know, if I'm just pumping out swarms or if I get a honey crop, who knows? This is my first year I'm going to do this. So, you know, if you're thinking about it, maybe use, you know, my season here and say, hey, I saw this guy and he did this and maybe he did this wrong and you can correct it. So that's why I'm going to share all this. But uh, appreciate you guys all watching. I'm going to get my stuff here packed up. Uh, get on home. So appreciate you guys watching. Uh, I'm going to get everything packed up here. And like I always say, until the next one. Mm -hmm.